Hey yo, what's going on everybody? It's Ram Name 951 Here bringing some unpackaging videos of some, some Supreme pickups I got. It just came in the mail like five minutes ago from that UPS man. And uh, let's get to it. So let me start with this one. So I got that open. Let's check out what I got. So nothing else is in that bag. Alright guys, so check it out. <clears throat> so, this <clears throat> is the Supreme um, collab with Sea Line uh, 20 liter Nimbu bag. Basically, it's like a dry sacks because, you know, over here in California, you know, it rains every day. We're always getting, you know, it's always snowing, raining, everything. I'm just kidding with you guys. But yeah, so I thought it was a pretty cool accessory just because. Just got your Supreme stickers. Check it out. And nothing else inside. Yes, yeah, so here it is. Um, check out real quick. So there's two sizes. There's like the five liter and twenty liter. And I got this on a restock. They restocked the like maybe two or three times. No, oh, damn, this thing is really big. I didn't think it was this big. See how big it is, and inside there's like some instructions. See here is C line dry bags. It says closed bag for all that. Make sure sealing strips are wrinkle free. Put whatever you need in there. Make sure that while folding holding strips together, push down on bag to burp out trap there. And fold tightly. So basically, it's, it's this bag is kind of like overkill as far as size. I think a five liter would have been good for like something if you want to take it to say, um, you know, like Sea World or you know, even Disneyland. You know, when you're going those those rides and some crap, they got water. You don't want to get your stuff if you don't want to leave your stuff behind, but you also don't want to get drenched. You know, so uh, or even if you're going to like maybe like I don't know Six Flags, Hurricane Harbor, or some sort of water park. You know, it'd be pretty cool. Keep your stuff dry. You just gotta make sure you, you close it correctly. Pretty cool piece. Um, something different. Got that new, new smell to it. So, pretty cool. Definitely, um, if you want something that you can commute, commute and carry with, I would say the five liter would be the way to go. It's more portable, and you know, it's uh, probably a lot smaller than this. But I mean, it's, it's, this this is pretty good too. Depending, like maybe. If you Put a jacket in there, or I don't know what it, what what you would want to put in there, but um, pretty cool. It's kind of overkill in the price, but um, retail was forty four plus ten bucks shipping plus my sales tax coming out to like almost sixty bucks. So pretty cool, pretty cool. So put that away. <clears throat> I got some more stuff coming on the way that probably won't be here till next week though. So that includes the motion logo. And some other crap. Oops. You pull out these instructions for the C line too. Almost forgot. Alright, so let's see what else we got. Alright, sorry about that. So here's the other bag. Nothing there. Just open the package. So let's see what this is. Some more Supreme stickers. That basic stuff though. Cool, but not cool. Here's my receipt. So this is the football top, extra large and dark teal. Came out to 90 bucks. Book. Pretty cool. Um, I was really like waiting on them to restock this. I thought like I wasn't waiting on them to restock it. I, I kind of like glanced over it when it came out because I, I think I was after something else. I forgot when this came out. I think it might have been during the Sasquatch collab or some something else i don't know but basically they they, they restocked on this thing a couple times more than a couple times um i'll take it out of the bag right now it's pretty dope um but yeah uh i was, I was on my app and they restocked like on almost every color um black you know sold out pretty quick but i wasn't really feeling black i want to go with the dark teal because i thought you know i'm tired of doing black it's too it looks almost like a raider kind of 
I'm not into football to begin with, and it looks like kind of like a Raider colors. I just want something to look nice, um, something you know, could wear just whenever. So I got a dark teal. Um, they restocked on dark teal like maybe twice, and you know it sold out every time. Honestly, like every time they restocked on these these football tops, every they sold out. You know, it's like Supreme does most of the time on most of their items. And uh, yeah, so. I got a dark teal extra large. Let me take it out of the bag so you guys can see them. Just put the receipt and the stickers back in the bag real quick. Pretty cool because they actually put the the tag with it. Sometimes they don't they don't do the tag, so something cool. Alright, so see here, got my little supreme tag. And they pat like little little something in here. It's pretty cute. For like a little paper. Get it out of the way real quick. I'm gonna open it up so you guys can see it fully. Give me a second. Alright, so here it is. It says Supreme in the back with like number 104. Not too sure what like the 104 stands for, honestly. Probably something to it. Just don't know what. Then down here they have like this little patch that says supreme extra large quality garments you can see it's like a nice little fabric kind of open it up check out the tags because the tags are pretty they're a little different pretty cool but different so you can check that out supreme new york city pretty cool that supreme's on there and you get the xl and here's the tag supreme um See there, extra large, dark teal, summer 16, spring summer, excuse me, spring summer 16, um, KN14, not sure what that is, and football top, yeah, so pretty cool little piece, it's uh, pretty light, Very, like really good for like, you know, um, spring summer, you can see how you can see through it already, that, I mean, it's a good shirt for spring summer, you know, you don't want that something heavy. But I just, I like the color a lot. I don't think I would like black, because black's just, it's too not, doesn't look too well. Oh, not, not right now. It's too hot to be wearing black. Yeah, so it's very, I like it. It's super clean, basic, but you know, I like it. It's probably going to be like that polo that I got. The I finally got the, the rope cord polo from this, this week. For the uh, what was this week's? Um, was there anything? I can't remember. I can't. Wow, well, that's bad. I can't remember for this week. Oh yeah, this week was a motion logo week. So like, yeah, I got the the rope cord polo. I think it was or something. It's like the design. <clears throat> I got that in black. I think that looks pretty clean. But like, it's going to going to be nice and light. You know, something airy. So it's. I like this piece a lot. Basic, but you know not. But then you still have the Supreme that you can rock because, you know, some people don't like when, like, they have a Supreme item, but, like, it's too subtle. Like, there's no big thing that pops out Supreme. I'm either for it. I'm usually for it. I'm not really against it. Like, if there's a piece that I like that's, you know, it's subtle, but um, it's clean, you know, I'll, I'll pick it up. Some people want to see where, like, oh, yeah, check out my shirt, you know, it says Supreme. And I'm not, I'm not like that, really. Uh, you know, that goes for the S logos, basically, you know. You know, uh, you you just wear it. You know, it doesn't necessarily say Supreme. They like for the the sweatshirts. You know, they have it on just the hoodie. For the hats, you know, it's on the back of the hat, but it's not like a big, you know, red um, Supreme logo saying Supreme on the hat. You know, so um, it's it's kind of it's just a nice shirt. Very cool. Material is pretty dope. I like it. Let's see here. Let's say what the material is. I lied, so it's actually 60% cotton and 40% polyester. Let's see here. There we go. It says care instructions. Do not iron. Why well, okay, it's made in China? You see that? Yeah, I mean, that's, that's this. It's a, like I said, nice clean shirt. Something you can use for every day. 
It's like a lounge in the house, or if you just want to go outside, you know, nice and sunny, just a nice chill shirt to wear. This dry land, this dry sack, basically, it's 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 cool. Um, I mean, this it's kind of like used kind of for maybe specific stuff. Um, I guess really good if like you're in a rainy state or something, or you're you're going like I said to Disneyland, or not Disneyland, but like say Sea World or or some sort of you know, um, uh, like park attraction where there's like a lot of water, you don't want to get your stuff wet. But you want to have like a nice big bag to carry everything, you know, that's that's pretty good. Um, something more for a commute, just to carry like maybe some electronics or something small. The 5 liter would be the way to go, but yeah, pretty cool little little pickup. Um, like I said, I ordered the Motion logo. I, old, I ordered those bolt cutters just to see how they are on that restock. It's just going to be hilarious when I get them. Um, I ordered the Polo, the Motion logo, what else? Um... Dang, there's something else I'm missing. I can't remember what I ordered, but there's there's something. Yeah, but that, that won't be until like next week, most likely. Yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed this little pickup video. Until next time, guys. Peace.